Well, the sun finally came out and I'm happy again. I'm down here taking care of this beautiful place I installed. All these beautiful palms everywhere. So many pretty things here. And uh, I was just starting to walk down this driveway. Go get the truck to do the last thing we have to do, which is trim the queen palms on the driveway. The other Guadalupe palms. The yucca. The strata. More Guadalupe palms. More yucca. But anyway, I was about to walk down this driveway and I was thinking, wow, looks really good. Maybe I should make a video to commemorate this moment in time and space. So here we are in this flying speck through the universe. And we've assembled this gorgeous array of queen palms that were all exactly the same height when I put them in. And pretty much exactly in a row. How'd I do? Look at that. Look how straight that is. I was so straight. I think I had a string line out here. But... Um, this one is supposed to be off because it, the driveway curves a little bit. Let's see how I do on this side. This was, I'm really bad about keep, keep keeping track of time. Seems like graduation from high school in 1987 was just like, I don't know, two or three weeks ago. Um, it's been fast forward ever since. I guess the more fun you have, the faster it goes, right? So let's do our little walk down the driveway. I'm about to actually... <laughs> I come down here four times a year to keep these things perfect. I have to cut the flowers out. See up here, I cut a flower out last time I was here, three or four months ago, and it's since grown up higher, so I'll have to recut that one. They really put out a lot of flowers in the summertime. You wanna get the flowers out because they drop a bunch of flower material, which is not so pretty. And then also they um, will make seeds and then they'll drop the seeds and make even more of a mess. And so my client likes them pretty neat, like trimmed up a bit. I like them just the way they are. But I will go through and trim off like one frond each, <laughs> believe it or not. But I think before I trim, I want to make the video because they just look so good right now. Look at this. They were going to use canary palms in here, and I'm like, those would be way too big. Plus, use canary palms. I'm not coming back to trim them. That's way too difficult. Look at this tree absolutely spectacular tree perfect in all regard had a really mild winter a couple times it's gotten cold enough to frost these trees a little bit believe it or not look at this one wow native to brazil i believe on the orinoco river um don't quote me but i think so and there's all kinds of different uh this is a Cyagris, the genus here. And um, there's a whole bunch of different Cyagris. This is Romans Ophianum. I like to think of it the romancing queen palm. And this one's winning the tallest war, tallest award. I don't know why. You get the same amount of water, same fertilizer. Look at this one's gotta be eight foot of trunk taller than that one. This one. It's one of the shorter ones. But look at this driveway. All you can do is start out with the same height. That's all you can do. That's all you can hope for. And uh, yeah, you have a big long driveway. Give me a call. I would love to make it a beautiful tropical palm tree tunnel. Just like this one.